Hello, my friends. B-Dog here. Well, as promised by Morgan Freeman, if you saw my preview earlier today, um, me being a goofball, I've got some really good tips for King of the Court. It's actually my first King of the Court tips video. Um, but I've got some huge tips on this event that make it incredibly easy um, and a way to get a 100% style bonus without having a 100% team. Uh, that you're actually playing with, but then also how to get some easier opponents. So um, there's going to be a lot here, and I'm also learning a lot about uh, King of the Court, I mean not King of the Court, just Season 5 in general, um, as they've changed things up. So um, quite a few things here that I want to get into. So let me start real quick by the Season 5. One of the things I learned, um, as you may have noticed, they have changed, depending on the event, your max team power will now sometimes include your power boost on your team, on your max team. So uh, kind of a big tip here that I'm going to be experimenting with is, depending on the event, some of them account for that boost. So if I want to enter an event um, without, you know, if I want to minimize my max power, you know, I'll bring in some people that do not have boost. I'll probably do this for like my doms, mini dom. I've got to see how it affects this event, but I, if I do that, it may recognize me as less power. I'm not quite sure yet. I definitely have seen it on a couple of events, so that's kind of a big deal. Um, just experimenting with boost and no boost because that may affect the opponents you get. Um, you know, their power. There's certain events that your max power does matter and it affects your opponents. So keep that in mind um, because I've noticed that 2K in Season 5 does add that boost to your max team total. So it's actually kind of a big deal if you're strategizing and want easier opponents. The next thing um, I want you to look at is pay attention. Go ahead and look at my opponent's powers now. So my power is at 91,407 on the top. Going down, you'll see that I have, you know, 30 to 40,000, well, maybe 20 to 30,000 higher on every single, I'm higher than every single opponent by about that much. And I want to show you how to get that low of opponents. Um, I can't do it yet because there's some uh, little tricks after you end one of the brackets. So as soon as I become the champion here after this game, I'll show you how to get easier opponents. And then the very last thing, you'll see that my team, um, I'm not playing with my full theme team. I do have a full theme team on team three. I'm not playing with that. So big tip on this event as well is that style bonus really doesn't matter. You'll see that you only get, um, you get a very minimal amount of points per quarter win and per game win. So the only thing we're going to be aiming for is that tournament champion at the end which is what I'm about to get um, my doubler I could use now but really that style bonus doesn't matter during the games but the reason I have so what you'll see is I've got team one is my lowest players possible team two is the team I want to actually play with I'm um, keeping in mind that I'll probably edit this uh, before starting my first game just to see what powers do and I'll show you what I mean by that after this game and then finally, team three is my 100% style bonus, and I can use this team to get a 100% style bonus on my tournament champion, tournament champion reward. So I'll show you how to do all of that. Um, so a lot of juicy tidbits here, um, and a little bit of explanation is needed after this game. So I'm going to go ahead and play this game manual. Um, auto, I'm not tending to get very... It's pretty close games, and I just want to keep full control of this, so I'm going to do manual for now, because I'm not overpowering my opponents by that much. Since I'm doing manual, I'll go ahead and throw in a doubler, um, free-to-play doubler, just because. I love my current team right now. Um, that LeBron Kobe boost is wonderful, and then, of course, um, Curry. But then I threw in some theme players as well, just to get some style bonus, because it does help. Um, and then, yeah, let's go for it. So I'll, I'll play this game, and then I'll, I'll show you the really juicy tidbits after this game, which you can only get into those juicy tidbits after you're done with one tournament. So um, I'll show you some gameplay real quick, uh, and then 
I did also want to show you some of the setup before I just finished this game, but it's it's crucial to do some of these steps at the end of your like your tournament champion game. So I'm just uh, I got Curry. I just I can run him out here. I do my same thing where I'm just three point crazy. Now that I'm overpowering them by twenty thousand, these are just you know you could do these games in your sleep. Auto may not win, but uh, Manual, it's easy on defense and on offense. Um, if I foul, I don't really care. There's zero strategy when you're overpowering your team by 20,000. It's how to get that overpowering that matters because if you don't do it right, then you will be playing teams that are um, higher power than you, and then king of the court becomes incredibly difficult. So, um, but now, now that I'm overpowering them, it's just so it's really easy. Um, my Kobe, I really like my Kobe. Let's see if I can get him to make one. He's not open. And he still made one, which is cool. Um, you can max your your event points per win, depending on the, you know, if you win by six points, if you win by, uh, I think it's six points or greater, then you get the max amount of points per game. So I'm trying to beat my opponent by six points or more on this quarter which again is really quite easy um, when you're overpowering this much. The event is difficult if you're not. So we will get into that. Um, but you'll see that because I'm overpowering them by so much, they miss a lot. I make a lot. Just really so easy. So um, I know there's a little bit of, you know, this is just kind of watching to watch, but the more important stuff comes in later as soon as this game is done. So you can at least hear me talk for a bit, I suppose. Super simple, I'm doing some auto, doing some manual. My offense, I always go manual. I do my zigzag on offense. Kobe really, for whatever reason, I'm struggling with him a bit. Um, getting open and then making my shots. I'm not getting any greens for him, so maybe my release sucks. Um, LeBron, I'm doing pretty good with. Let's see if I can get one shot with LeBron. There, Kyrie hit one, but let's try LeBron. Remember my one tip where you can't make a three twice in a row with the same player. Where's LeBron? Hit him. Okay, hit it. No, that wasn't a three, but he still made it. I'm at any rate. Remember to rotate between your shooters um, because you won't hit two shots in a row with the same player. And so I rotate between Kobe, LeBron, and Curry. Okay, now we're finally getting to the good stuff. Okay, so I won, which is great. Um, go ahead and click through, but you don't don't click fast because uh, here's where the tips will come in. So um, unless they changed it, um, they may, they may have changed it. Hang on, no, no. Okay, so I didn't get my tournament champion reward yet. Okay, so big thing here, you can get you, click your um, draft picks, but then immediately, do not hit continue. Do not do not do not hit continue. Close out of your game. So I'm closing out, and this may take a second. Get back into the game. This is where you get your full event points. This is a huge, huge tip. Um, so I'm going to go through like normal. And what you can do, hopefully, if they didn't change anything, and they may have, cha they may have changed something, but let's just see. Perfect. Okay, so now switch to your 100% style bonus team. Select... Now when I go into my event, watch this. Tournament champion, I get 100% event points. Huge tip. So that gives me, that means I don't have to play with my theme team to get full champion points. Okay, and then again, do not click replay. Another big tip here, don't click replay. Instead, close out one more time. And this is how we're going to get low opponents for your all of your bracket, for your teams in your bracket. So, you know, people may not like me pointing this out, but I'm a free-to-play player, and I'm trying to do everything I can to get max amount of points, and I'm also trying to help you guys. A lot of people think that this uh, event is impossible, or at least hard, because it becomes really hard if you don't do this. So now I'm going to go back to Team 1, before entering the event, big thing. Don't enter the event yet after you close. Select your lowest team possible on team one. 
I go into head to head a bit and then I might go into turning a bit. I want it to just make sure that I'm selected on my lower team. And actually the other thing, just to experiment, I'm going to remove my highest plays here. I don't want any power boosts. And I'm going to add, once it catches up, I'm just going to add pe players that won't give me any power boost here. Um, no power boosts. Let's go here. Okay, no power boost. I'm still not going to select that team. So I'm selected on my minimum team. I don't have any power boosts in place. Let's just go head to head one more time and tourney. What you should see now, if I'm selected on my minimum team, when I click into the event, is much lower teams. So it pops up here, but then close out. So look at that. So I'm at 90 something thousand. I've got 60, 60, 81, 62, 89, 59. So I wrote, I re-roll quite a few times because I'm watching, um, last time I got my lowest, so the highest opponent team in the whole bracket was 71,000. So I'm going to re-roll and let's just rotate through and see what we can get. So highest there is 89 at the second from the bottom. 89 is too high for me. I'm just going to keep moving. Going down here. So see, take a look. That was That's 75. That's a pretty good bracket to play. I don't know if I can win on auto, but that's a good bracket to play. I'm just going to keep re-rolling for a second and just see what we get here. So 89, second to last on the bottom. Um, all of these are winnable manual, every single one. I was just, I'm trying to just see what type of opponents I can get. So there's a 71 right there. Everybody's 60s to 50 and then 71. So I like that bracket. So then just to lock it in, I always make sure that I click on this first game. Going to hit play. Then I can go back to my team. So I can just... I could actually, so that bracket is fully locked in. Those opponents will not change. So I can change this max team now to whatever players I like the most. Um, in this case, I still really like my LeBron and my Kobe duo. And then Curry's just Curry, right? And look at this, look at these stats. Maxed out three, maxed out two. I love his shoe. Um, I made a, I made a, um, a mentor with one of my Steph Curry's, so he's got just he's a beast. I love that guy. Um, Kobe, I've got a pretty good shoes on. Max three. Can't ask for much better than that. My LeBron, I could do. Oh my goodness! So <laughs> I've already yeah. I'm just gotta switch that. Look at I, that's funny. So I'm gonna go to a shoe that has. Uh, I've got one of these shoes that has twos. Let's see here. There was one of my maxed out twos, but I think I have a shoot off the dribble and a two pointer shoe somewhere here. Hopefully, if not, I've got others as well. Okay, so so there's a couple of choices I could make here. I've got quite a bit of shoes. Nothing nothing that great. But what I'll do, um, I'm going to go back to. Sorry for all the scrolling here, but I'm going to go back to. Um, this guy. I think I like this runner. So now I should have almost max twos. I got max three, and then a one shoot off the dribble. So great stats there. I can't believe I didn't have that set before. I don't even have a mentor on him. Um, I hate that mentors cost, so I just don't have a mentor. But I've got a great shoe. I'm just trying to upgrade. Similar to uh, Bam, I've got. A shoe I'm just really trying to upgrade I don't really care about those guys but again just a reminder now that I'm locked into my bracket if I really wanted I could bring in some of my more power players um, and then I could just really dominate and I may be able to do auto and I in fact I may just I don't know I'm a perfectionist so I may like the style bonus but really um, I've got some good players here I don't have a mentor on him let's look at Kind of like I kind of like that Yao. At any rate, um, you can really do whatever you want with this team because now I'm locked into that bracket, and this this team might win on auto. Um, and if I actually remove Curry, and I bring in this is one of my favorite lineups right here. 
because now I get a power boost on Peyton, power boost on Garnett, power boost on Yao, and then the duo boost. So I've got 15,000 here. So I'm just going to try this on auto and we'll see how it goes. Um, you guys can hang with me if you want, but those were the tips. So please, you know, those one steps, follow through those steps. Um, I'll just hit continue and I'm just going to see how they do on auto. Um, but those those steps, clicking through is incredibly, uh, incredibly important the way you do that. Uh, and you've got to do it in that sequence in order to get 100% champion points, but then also the way to get lower opponents. So uh, best of luck, you guys. It's a very easy event. Those, uh, those tricks are still working, which is awesome. So let's just uh, let's see how you guys do. Hopefully it all works for you. Kind of experiment with your teams a bit. Um, but it becomes a super easy event. Um, easy top reward. And we'll just see how... I mean, there's this is one where people can auto and they get high in the brackets and you get your hackers. So I don't know what bracket we'll get. But this definitely maximizes your points free to play. So uh, best of luck, you guys. If you have any questions, let me know. Um, yeah, give me any any suggestions, any questions. I try to answer as much as I can. Just really trying to help you guys. Um, and if you need a good laugh, check out my video from earlier today with uh, Morgan Freeman impression. So anyway, take care, you guys. Um, best of luck in this event. B-Dog out.